Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we have one very, very interesting and challenging question from log equations. The given equation is a square root 1 plus x power log 3 plus 3 power log x plus x power log 9 equal to 27 power log x minus 23. And we have to calculate real solutions only. So let's get started by writing two most powerful log properties which I will use. Property number 1 log a power b it will be equal to b log a and second property it is a power log b which will be equal to b power log a. Let's apply to our equation. Now I will use substitution. Let us consider this is equal to k. So let 3 power log x using property 2 this will be same as x power log 3. Let us call this is equal to k. Now I will calculate x power log 9 and 27 power log x separately in terms of k. So let me write here x power log 9. I can write this will be equal to x power log 3 square. Using property number 1, I can write x power 2 log 3. And using exponent property, can we write equal to x power log 3 whole square. Now x power log 3 is k. So this will be equal to k square. Now let's calculate 27 power log x. Using property 2, I can write x power log 27. Further 27 can be written as log 3 cube. Using property 1, x power 3 log 3. Using exponent property, I can write x power log 3 whole power 3 equal to x power log 3 is k. So this will be k cube. And property of exponent was a power b times c equal to a power b whole power c. Now let's plug in these values to our equation. So I will be writing our equation as a square root 1 as it is plus now x power log 3. Now x power log 3, 3 power log x. Both values we will write k. So let me write here k plus k plus x power log 9. It is k square. So I will be writing here k square in RHS 27 power log x. It is k cube. So RHS will be k cube minus 23. Now left hand side I can write the square root of 1 plus 2k plus k square equal to k cube minus 23. Now this is one algebraic formula. The square root of k plus 1 whole square. RHS is k cube minus 23. Cancel square root with power 2. So this is k plus 1 only. RHS is k cube minus 23. Take all the term to RHS. So k cube minus k minus 24 equal to 0. This is one cubic equation. I will solve this equation using method of factorization. Now I can write our equation as k cube minus k minus 24 can be written as minus 27 plus 3 equal to 0. Now k cube minus 27 
then I can write minus k plus 3 equal to 0. Now 27 can be written as 3 q and minus 1 is common then in bracket k minus 3 equal to 0. Now I will apply here a cube minus b cube formula. Let's apply. So I can write k cube minus 3 cube minus 1 k minus 3 equal to 0. Let's apply formula. a q minus b q a minus b a square plus b square plus a b plus 9. Then we have minus 1 times k minus 3 equal to 0. Now k minus 3 is overall common. Now in bracket I can write k square plus 3k plus 9 minus 1 equal to 0. k minus 3 times k square plus 3k plus 8 equal to 0. Now product is 0. I can conclude two equations. First one k minus 3 will be 0 and second equation this quadratic will be 0. Let us check this quadratic equation first. I will write only the discriminant value delta b square minus 4ac. So b is 3, 3 square minus 4 times a is 1, c is 8. This will be equal to 9 minus 32 which is equal to minus 23. Now discriminant is negative. Conclusion will be complex solutions will generate. So we can reject this part. Complex solutions. So this quadratic will be rejected. So which equation we are going to accept? It is k minus 3 equal to 0. So from here I can conclude k equal to 3. Now let us solve as per substitution. So I can write x power log 3. This was our k. Or I can write 3 power log x using property 2 equal to 3. Now I can compare both sides. So I can write 3 power log x equal to 3 power 1. Bases are same. I will compare both the powers. It must be equal to each other. So log x equal to 1 or I can write log 10 because log is having base 10. Comparing both sides, I can write x equal to 10. This is our solution. x is equal to 10, the only real solution. Let's verify. So I will write here verification. x equal to 10 LHS. I will be writing here square root of 1 plus. Can we write here x power log 3? So better is to write here 3 power log x using property 2. And here I will be writing 3 power log x whole square for this term. So let me write 3 power log x. So 3 power log 10 plus 3 power log 10 plus 3 power log 10 whole square. This is our LHS. Let's simplify. Log 10 we know it is 1. Log 10 equal to 1 because of base 10. So I can write LHS equal to square root of 1 plus 3, 3 power 1, it is same as 3, 
plus 3 square. So it will become a square root of 1 plus 3 plus 3 is 6, 6 plus 9, 15. So this is a square root 16. It will give us 4. Now let's check RHS. I can write RHS equal to 27 power log x. So 27 power log 10 minus 23. Log 10 is 1. So 27 minus 23 which is giving us the same value 4. Hence this solution is verified. And this brings the end of this video. Thank you friends for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye.